And this is kind of the golden question, I think, in Mets land right now. This one from uh, Nunya, who said, what hitter should the Mets add to round out the lineup? Maybe a fourth outfielder who can also DH against lefties. Players that come to mind, Duvall, Drury, J.D. Martinez. I, I like the framing of this question because I think it's very realistic. This could be the market they could play in. And Joe, I think everybody kind of has their eyes on and goes, what is J.D. Martinez contract going to look like? Because is that one the Mets could swoop in and steal on a very short term, bloated one year ish kind of deal? I think they could. I, I don't I see so why too. not as long as his back checks out. But I think I think barking up the right shoe when you talk about almost like fourth outfielder almost type like when they acquired Darren Ruff. You know, obviously, we don't have to talk about how it didn't work out, but the vision was this is a guy who has historically met, matched lefties even recently. So it's not like you're going back far in time to find Darren Ruff hitting lefties. Uh, and he also can play first base. He can play the corner outfield spots, kind of like he could stand out there if, if you need him to. So I think you're going to see the Mets pursue someone that does something similar. I think Adam Duvall crushes lefties. He's a good defensive player that could actually even play some. Yeah, and he could play some center field for you too. I think he was plus four OOA um, in in center field this year, so I think he fits really well. I think Trey Mancini is a name that we we should keep an eye on. We talked about him at the trade deadline. Uh, obviously, he has the relationship with Buck Showalter. He struggled in Houston, but he has the ability to kind of play multiple spots. And J.D. Martinez is kind of your prototypical slugger that you have to check out the back, make sure everything checks out there. Uh, but the defensive versatility there is probably lacking. So I'm interested to see where the Mets go, because I do think they need to add one more bat. And that bat could be someone that shares time at DH, spends some time in the outfield. I think I'd be hard-pressed to sign another pure DH, where now you're carrying two players whose only job is to hit. I, I don't think that's the best uh, use of roster spots.